Alrighty, welcome to episode 25 of the Consistent Genius Podcast. I'm here with Matt Dorncott and CJ Rotherman. Hello. Hello. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> Today we have a wide range of topics, but first I want to address the problem at hand. CJ got out of senior tag by Hitler himself. <laughs> yeah. uh, James making Bartman. A, making a ruling. <laughs> That is some fugazi is what that is. So let, let's hear the whole story. <clears throat> so basically it was me, Ryan Marty, and you were there, right? Or no. Was it you? Oh, yeah, I was there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You were in the back seat. So it was us three, and we were on Nicole Adams' oh, yeah, ass. Cook, Cook was there. Yeah, oh, and <laughs> Cook was there. And uh, we were following her for probably about 45 minutes or so and try to create a diversion to get us off her. Didn't work. We're still on her. And she pulls us into <clears throat> this parking lot. And we're, like, we're so, like, hyped up on adrenaline. Yeah. Like, we don't realize what's going on, you know? So we pull in. She parks her car. And uh, two girls actually get out of the car. Yeah, but hold on. Hold on. <laughs> we didn't think this through. Like, they get out of the car. There's no reason they were getting out of the car. They just were going to <laughs> yeah, the other car. There would be no reason for them to get out of the car. Yeah, clear they, diversion to try and get us out, but so didn't they see it. they yeah. planned the uh, they planned this. clearly the yeah. clearly this yeah. was planned. Mason was there, like it was they the other car us. was Mason was he was on yeah. the team. Oh, well, he was so. like posted up waiting yeah. for you guys. Yeah. Dang, yeah. that's crazy. Was Cook Dog driving? No, I was. <laughs> that has to be your getaway driver. <laughs> nah, he doesn't have his license. He's like fourteen. <laughs> <laughs> Does he talk? I've yeah. never seen him yeah. talk or anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah he right. talks around us. I mean, he just doesn't really feel comfortable around a lot of people i guess is he yeah. smooth with the uh, ladies i think so yeah <laughs> is he a beast yeah he's a beast all around <laughs> all, right. all around beast yeah so you're out of senior tag which sucks who do you think is going to win it all ben sarver's team yeah i think ben sarver's i hope they win it all it i don't know if they will ben sarver's a sub right for fang and them medical crack yeah, medical, medical crack. crack. Yeah. Have you, you guys follow the instagram account and stuff yeah yeah it's yeah, yeah. Oh, hilarious they followed me a while ago i was like what the fuck is this? Like, are you <laughs> kidding me? Like, this is the dumbest thing ever. And then they then they explained it to me, and I was like, that's amazing. <laughs> that is absolutely amazing. Hats off. They paid, like, 600 for the dildo. Yeah, that's we were crazy. with them. Uh, and he's like, yeah, we're about to pay 600 We're like, dude, are you stupid? <laughs> like, you're going to pay 600 Like, I guess he just has a personal grudge against the other team. Yeah. I, I mean, I bet the team would have, like, settled for 300 the team that had yeah, it. They yeah. Like, yeah, they probably would have. Yeah, yeah, they would have. They told me. Yeah, so yeah. six hundred dollars is insane. And then I saw like something like maybe a tweet or Instagram post. Like they they were gonna pay like twelve hundred for the next one if they find it. I guess they. Were, I mean, they were probably joking, but like, yeah. what the next one? That the the anal beats. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, the, yeah. So the dildo was found last night. Yep. yep. It was under the stairs at Leather Lips. All right. So, do you have any clue how? Uh, Somebody figured out that clue. Did you see the clue? I didn't see the clue. Here. Well, I can no. Pull that so out the rule. Need. Yeah. You, you didn't see the clue. Wait, are you in a team? No, you're out. Yeah, we're I out. Know, but yeah. I still have matter. the clue. Okay. Well, no, because I heard. If you're out, you can still get the clue. Nah, but no, you can't. Adolf Bartman, he uh, he made a rule that the clue is only for the team captains and their <sighs> team. So like outside players can't know it. But why not? <laughs> I don't know. Clue. Actually, yeah, I can see why. Actually. Is it backwards? No, it's not. We tried everything. Is it E S P O T was S P O T was T D Stupi Lizer S P? I don't know what that means. Yeah, I don't know. The, the, someone figured it out or no? Yeah, it's probably Somebody like a. Somebody clearly uh, figured it out if they found it. Like you know, like those things where like you'll take like a letter in your name and like make a new name with the same letters. Yeah, I was thinking it was like, like the, when I started reading it in my head, it was like Ob. Like that's the first thing that came to <laughs> my mind. Like, <laughs> like that's just how my brain was. I was like, is that Ob? Oh my god! If we were still in, we'd win. <laughs> Bartman ain't that smart. But, but yeah. so no one knows what it was. Somebody found it. Yeah. Well, I don't think they found it through that. I think they were just looking because I heard the girl told me she was outside for three hours naked. Oh, I know, I know who found it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. but I'm not saying obviously. Well, she's been on the podcast. Yeah. Oh wow! Yeah, that's wow. crazy. Yeah, that's true. But mm. good for them. They have that, and they're playing. Oh, they're playing Morbido's team. He's been mm. on the podcast three times. He's actually like I think number one guest right now because like he's really good at like just talking and stuff. Fact, he's fact. a big talker. Yeah, yeah he's big good. talk guy. Yeah. But, so they have those. So wow, that might be an easy, uh, easy win for them. If they just stay inside, stick to the yeah. 
Yeah, they could probably do that. Or they could sell it. Make some, some cash. Well, yeah. See, that's why I'm it. saying, like, that's, that's why Bartman needs to say that people outside the game can still find it because yeah. there's people that still want to be in the game. Like, honestly, like, senior tags want to uh, Like, I want to keep playing. Me and Pete yeah, but, like, like, that kind of makes it unfair for the teams in the game. Think about it like that. Like, you're not in the game and you're trying to get it and sell it to teams who are playing. Well, well that's just find it, no, find it quicker. Yeah. Find it quicker. Yeah. <laughs> me and Petro, we were at uh, the corn maze when Evan mm-hmm. found it. And like he like grabbed it. Were you there? Yeah. No, I was no, not we there. I was we were at baseball. there at the time, ah, like crazy. before that. But yeah, so he like grabbed it and like tucked it and ran. So like no one saw it. And then once they're all in the car, like one of them like held it up or something. Damn. And like we're like, damn. damn. But so we saw that happen. But we're gonna be trying to find the. I heard Bartman dug it like six inches into the ground. There's no yeah. way. No, dude. that's what he told us. Like, how sh- how, Devin how it do you? Then? Yeah, dude, you can't just like. There's no way you just go around with like a shovel and dig around uh, leather, every corn. I mean, not leather lips. Every at, piece at the of corn, corn there. No, they I said did hear. no. They they. All right. So Dzinski told me they buried it under like one piece of corn, obviously, <laughs> but they dug eighteen different holes. Eight to like throw yeah. people off. Yeah, one throw eight. People off. Eighteen. Wow. <sighs> Wait, that's insane. Because I heard the there was that's something they about just like 18. eighteen holes. I heard there was a rule about or a clue that was going to be like eighteen. So maybe if you found all eighteen holes, you just got to check them or something. Yeah, but, but I also heard there's a map that was up in the trees. Yeah, was, yeah. But I don't understand. I still understand how they just dug up holes like that at that point. Like, <laughs> One of the savage, because like Bartman, I heard like when he went and checked it, like he said, "Oh, I'm gonna go around and like check like five different spots." I guess he checked all eighteen yeah. to wow. like throw people off, maybe. Maybe Evan was just watching him. Yeah, I had to have had eyes on that. It's wild. Do you guys listen to the Call Her Daddy podcast? No. What is it? You ever heard it? Call her daddy. Mm-mm. Never heard it. It's these two hoes. Oh yeah, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I think I know. Dude, I think I know what you're talking about. It is fire. Everyone I turn on to it loves it. Yeah, yeah. And mm-hmm. they were for Barstool, so it's like. Yeah. Yep. I know exactly just, who you're talking they're just about. They're sweet, and like they're beautiful women. They are. They're two beautiful they are. women. But That's dude, fact. like on the podcast, they'll talk about like how they like Photoshop all their pictures and stuff too. So you gotta be careful. Damn. That's fucked. Women are deceiving. The power of social media now. I mean, you just post anything and you turn it into whatever you want. It's wild. It's crazy. I mean, it's shit. I so re- deceiving. I always put a filter on my pictures. I mean, I do too, but, like, I'm not, like, you know, going pro, like, on, like, my computer trying oh, to, like, yeah. Yeah. digitalize every it, single it, aspect I of might, my I face. Might throw, <laughs> I might throw, like, a different, like, color filter over it, maybe, like, but, like, I'm not editing yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah there's like those know? girls that like they'll be like in front of like a brick wall and like you see like one of the bricks goes off to the side <laughs> <Nah>. <laughs> that is that's my favorite I that's think hilarious. We're going out. Good. all right boys quick lightning round i mean we could get deeper deeper in discussion real quick for it but one thing you guys want to do before you die <sighs> something that's like something that takes a while like not just like you know like like yeah i know what you mean like you know Go on a roller coaster. Some yeah. BS like that. <laughs> no, it has to be like amazing. I don't know, man. That one's. I feel like there's a lot of things that fall into that category for me. I would love to go skydiving. That's the first thing that comes to my oh, mind. That's cool. But that's like, that's that's a, no, but that's also like one of those things. You know? well, well, no, because how skydiving. often, how many people do you know that have gone skydiving? Yeah, exactly. I know a lot of people that have gone skydiving. I swear. <laughs> Name five. Yeah. I've named, I know one. My cousin. I know one also. My cousin, She's too. on Broadway. That's crazy. She played on Fiddler in the Roof on Broadway. No way. Yeah. Very and talented. That's sweet. Beautiful voice. <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, I don't think I can name five, but, like, I know a lot of people. <laughs> I don't think I can name five. Okay, what's your thing, man, that you want to do before you die? I don't know, dude. Like, <laughs> now you got me thinking, like, it can't be, like, one of those things like that, though. A threesome. That's yours. All right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that's I would love fair. to time travel. If he has been to like, I can't have time it. travel would be pretty sweet. Set, like I, mm, I'm telling you, man. Or just like to go back five years. Like if you had the knowledge you had now, went back five years. Like you could do oh my so god. much. Oh my god. Yeah. If yeah. you predicted stuff, oh. especially the senior year, I feel very. I felt. I don't know. Matured in a way. Yeah. Just because of senior year, yeah. your brain develops differently and stuff. That's so, nice. like, getting ready right. for the real. Uh, you have more speaking knowledge. of that, can we uh, come up with like our own topics of this? Yeah. All right. So, you want to talk about like how like the past week, like the same thing has been happening to us? 
That's that's unreal, dude. That's some like some freaky shit that like is very hard to explain. It's so hard to, to explain certain just people. Cause, like it just happens to like me and him, and then it'll just be like, "What the hell?" Like that just happened. What is it? Like at work uh, the other day, this just happened. Uh, you work at uh, the pizza place, right? No, no, Charlie's, no, no, no. the oh, sub Charlie. place. Oh, oh you both were there. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Please don't come through. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we, don't, we don't want your business. Yeah. <laughs> no. All right. Go and, away. Uh, uh, so, like, I come back from the bathroom. I'm like, oh, no wonder my pants have been sagging all day at work. My button broke. And she's just like, no way. My button just broke, too. And then, like, <laughs> the other day, like, uh, uh, so this Lena girl, do you know who that is? Oh no, my God. That's a whole nother topic on its own. All right. So yeah, that's a whole nother topic on its own. We'll bring that <laughs> okay. up after, but this girl that's been like Snapchatting a bunch of people. I don't know who the hell yeah. she is. Don't expose her to, Oh wait, she had me too. Ah! Wait, she like sends like, Oh, I'm so horny. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, like, yeah some bullshit like that. Yes. Yeah. Like, what is that? Right. So she snaps us both like the same thing and then we both snap her back like the exact same picture in our car like the same word and everything like <laughs> yeah literally word by word it was the same exact sentence that we like sent her. we weren't even together either and then he came in the car and he's like yeah i just sent her like this picture i was like no you did not <laughs> yeah like the same thing like just stupid stuff like that but it happens like every day like five times a day and there's Man. there's plenty of times where it it happens again and it's it's a it's a bigger like it's like like, like, like it's a bigger like scenario, you know what I mean? Like, like that you'd have to like understand it. Like yeah. you'd have to like I don't yeah. know, but it's hilarious like when it happens. Yeah, and it's it's crazy though because it's like it's almost like to me it's like a deja vu feeling. Yeah. It's like like that's oddly familiar. Just it's so like the feeling of that is just like why? Like what is why did that happen? And like ever since that has been happening like you know deja vu like people think it's like once in a while like for me it's pretty consistent i would say like deja vu is very consistent for me i have it do you think there's like (laughs) do you think there's like another uh dimension yes yes absolutely you believe in aliens yes i well aliens it depends on like aliens or anything that's not us so yes yes, there's other things if you say like that i guarantee that there's other things out there we need to find Mm -hmm. them I wonder if they're like like people or if they're just like like entities. A pig. It could be no. no like it could also be no. Oh, oh. dude, it could but be entities. Yeah, it mean. could like, be like bacteria. Like yeah, it's well, bacteria life. too. Yeah, it's yeah. life still. Yeah. yeah, dude, the universe is huge. It's we're massive. so we're so small when you think about it. We dude. are. We are. I saw a picture like they put like Australia over the United States, and Australia like is kind of like bigger than the United States. Oh, yeah, Australia's I huge. That. I never knew that actually. I thought yeah. the United States was like huge but australia is like its own whole continent correct you can't yeah. be like yeah, that's what yeah. i thought like nobody's all over it though like you're only on the coast. right yeah because yeah. like most yeah. of desert, desert yeah. i think they got some crazy mm-hmm. stuff like they got kangaroos and i don't think kangaroos are anywhere else that's like the uh galapagos islands like had the uh unique like birds and what stuff. are those things those those galapagos islands galapagos islands charles darwin no, those are off like uh south america Oh, like, something like that like and they had uh, on the west side of south america it was like every island had like a different form so like one bird on one island could fly and then it would be like the same bird but without flight wow so like he saw that evolution was real. wow wow that's yeah. crazy it's great and i heard someone told me that like the turtles like the real old turtles were like first there like the first turtles to like ever like, no, no 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 like oh like that's how we figured out old turtles exist like you know how like that turtle at the pet store is like Oh yeah, it's like okay. First of all, I swear every time I go in there, it's his birthday. Like, <laughs> like ironically, every single time I go into Petland, it's his birthday. Well, it's a month, man. <laughs> but yeah, I think he's like what 120 or something like that. Jesus, he's, I mean, they live to be up there. I think turtles live long, whales live long, mm. and then like parrots, like parrots. The, yeah, like the red ones. Parrots are very intellectual. They are. They could talk, man. Yeah, That's like crazy. and just insane. like an animal, like. All those movies about talking dogs and all, you know, like, well, it's kind of real. Like, yeah. we have a, an animal, a bird, you know, that can speak to us, like, yeah. repeat us. Like, what? Yeah. You think uh, that movie, Planet of the Apes, where the ape talks, you think that, that could ever happen? No. Mm, I feel like that they, they couldn't talk necessarily, but they, sooner or later, I believe, they will start 
taking human like figures and like yeah. you know human like motions and stuff yeah. well you know like and some s- of them start like to sign do language what we do. and stuff sign language yeah like one of them can yeah. like communicate with you and there's that's over like thousands of words like i can imagine that that's wild have a conversation with a gorilla and then like dogs are pretty smart too like they can figure out some crazy stuff yeah but i heard though my my uncle is he's very smart his name's mikey he's probably well known in the Dublin territory <laughs> Jumping over pool fences, pool hopping at two AM. <laughs> but uh no, he's he's a very wise guy. And uh he's had plenty of dogs in his life and he's he he knows a lot about them. He said that dogs they're like like how mu- how long they focus for is like fifteen seconds. Like that's really? all they can do. And that's yeah. why it's like one time you say sit. Like if they're looking at you and you say sit, they'll sit. But if they're not like paying attention to you, blah blah blah, like they don't know what's going on, you know. Yeah. So I just I just thought that was pretty interesting. Yeah. But uh, no, another thing I wanted to talk about. We're also like so much further than any other animal intellectually. Oh like, yeah, we are. There's yeah. No way any we are could ever Yeah. Come past us. Yeah. Like we're like the nat- the biggest predator now. Yeah, oh, yeah right. we're at the, the top of the food chain. I know, like, yeah. For insane long time. Years. Yeah. Which Ew. is so messed up. Yes. We're, not, we're not even the top. We just, like, own it. Yeah. We, own <laughs> we have, like, guns and stuff, so it's, like... Yeah. Nah. Do it's you unfair. Guys, do you guys think there's, like, a megalodon, like, the big shark? Yeah. I honestly think there might be. Maybe multiple, actually. I mean, yeah. Well, literally... there has to be multiple, right? Because the... Oh, yeah, there, there has yeah. to be. There has to be multiple. Do you, do you think there's something like uh, Bigfoot and the Loch Ness Monster? Mm, Bigfoot mm. controversial. I mean, no, no, I don't think I don't think so. No, not Bigfoot or the Yeti. I mean, that kind of goes back to like what I said about the apes. You know, that's those people are drinking. I think later China. on, <laughs> <laughs> they yeah, seeing things. It's very easy for a six foot four man to put on a gorilla costume and ironically look back at a camera when someone is filming them, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then keep walking into the woods, but. We should fake the Bigfoot sightings around Dublin. We could do it right, right here. here. Yeah. Right there. Yeah. Right there. So right back there. Look at that. It. That'd be crazy. Viral video real quick. Yeah. Put the oh podcast on it. <laughs> do it with that camera. Just like see somebody <laughs> out there. Right now. Imagine we were just sitting here and like something like climbed up a tree. That'd it's, be sick. Yeah. What do you th- that'd be so sick. I'd be like, oh my God. What is that? <laughs> it's it's just, crazy. It's just your dad like climbing up a tree. <laughs> Mm. There will be squirrels that like climb up on this because like oh look there's a squirrel right now so like they put dude up. that squirrel's been there for like thirty I swear oh, yeah. I've been looking there's, at it the whole time there's a bunch of them that go up there a bunch of birds like because they put a bunch of bird food out there it's like a buffet for man buffet buffet so like there will be a couple of squirrels on the top and like one of them will jump over and like they leap over to that thing leap over times the fence day. all the way down to the ground no on the so they sit on the top and they leap Shit's to the acrobatic. tree you see that tree right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So land on it, and the tree will like fall, but like then they'll just go on the branch. Oh, watch! Like he might do it right now. Holy shit! He's getting oh oh he's going oh to the top. he's going the top rope. <laughs> so my dad said, and I told this last week, but there was two like squirrels at the top, and then like one jumped, but the other one jumped like a millisecond after. <laughs> we saw it, dude. So like it was like that. So the first one lands, and so it pulls the tree down. So the second one misses and just hits <laughs> the floor. <laughs> But yeah, Damn, that's insane. Those things can take a hit, that's though. Wild. Yeah. Think about it. They probably fall out of trees all the fucking time. They're durable. Yeah, they probably do. <laughs> no, they weigh they weigh so little that like it doesn't hurt. Yeah. You think? Yeah. That's like no ants can't die from any distance. Really? Yeah. That's like a cockroach. Like they just they float. Ants just float. I found it. Never mind. What? I'm not gonna say that. You found a cockroach? <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> that's right. just gross. I shouldn't be talking about that on live live. Uh, the YouTube. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> We're on iTunes, YouTube, Spotify, Google Play. We're on oh, everything. Dog. Google Play. Google Play. Yeah, for those That's Android so users. Yeah. <laughs> Perez. <laughs> no, Perez. Perez got an iPhone now, yeah, dude. No, I yeah, FaceTimed no, him. I'm like, hey. <laughs> gang, gang. That's hilarious. All right. What's your favorite pickup lines? If you're going to speak to a man. Oh, a female. What's your pickup line? <laughs> What's your pickup line? <laughs> Come on, Billy. <laughs> what? Um. Uh. I don't even know. Like, yeah, I don't have pickup lines. I just. <laughs> yeah. I don't ever like talk to girls. Like, 
actually. <laughs> oh, that's a little sus, but. I mean, yeah, I mean, ah, pick up lines. What I mean, has that's... 36 teeth and holds back the Incredible Hulk? My, <laughs> My zipper. zipper. <laughs> <laughs> that's a classic. It is. Or, um, yeah, dude. Or just hit her with the hay with three Y's. Hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> or what's up, smiley face. Are you face. talking just like, oh, man. If you're signing the DMs, I'm going to be honest a couple times, you know, I sent the dog, and then after that you say, Max, come back here. Oh, dude, sorry, send, he's always getting away. If you send pickup lines, you just sound like a huge asshole. <laughs> yeah, dude, for real. Get the fuck out of here. Have you guys seen the E6 thing? Yeah, hilarious. What? <laughs> hilarious. So I send this girl E6. It's funny. It's not, it's it, not cute, though. Like, you're not getting any girl like that. She liked it. I got the ad on Snap. It'll work. That's where you <laughs> shut up. You go from the DMs to Snap. Shut up. To text to meet. So I send her E6, and she's like, "What?" And I'm sorry, like, "Oh, I thought this was a vending machine. I just wanted a snack." <laughs> and then she tweeted that out. Yeah. Well, no, she said, "Can I tweet this?" I'm like, "Yeah, because I want clout. You know, get them followers." Wow. wow. It, it was well that's worth a, it. That's a real thing, clout. Yeah, is Dude, that a real a thing? Cloud beast. That's a cloud. We talked about that. Cloud with is stupid. Andre and Caroline were like, CJ always dresses best. Oh wow, because he's a cloud beast. But that's a good thing. Yeah, I definitely appreciate that. Yeah. But, uh, personally, I don't feel like people appreciate the way you dress. Me? Yeah, yeah I don't feel like they really like does. the uh, for like homecoming. You wore like the red pants with the jean jacket. Like mm-hmm. that was like drip. Yeah, that was nice. Uh, yeah. I was very proud of myself. That. Possibly could have been some of my best work. Um, <laughs> uh, I try. What are you doing for prom? I've, I I don't know. Yeah, I have a nice jacket that I could wear. Um, it's the one I wore to Florida, but I mean it looks good. I have a pink shirt, green shirt. You I don't like, know what I want, but I don't know, like pink and green. Pink that. and green. Yes, that's those are my mom's two favorite colors. Actually, she loves yeah. pink and green together. Uh, she she would go nuts. She's like, <laughs> oh my god! Whoa. But yeah. you look like the Easter Bunny. <laughs> eh, it's April. Happy Easter! Yeah, it is almost Easter. That's what is it right now? Lent. I don't know. I don't do that. Yeah, and, I mean, I I don't give up anything. I'm a savage. Yeah, like, like you <laughs> chill, <do> it, <laughs> I'm a savage. I don't give up anything. Wow, you're a savage. I take what I want. Like, yeah, you don't, you don't obey God. You savage. Yeah, in fact, <laughs> what the fuck? Obviously, there's a God yeah. or some type there's of higher, a higher power. power. Yeah, some type of higher power that higher power that someday we will have to answer to. Hmm, I don't know what's that is like unfortunately but you, know. you think crazy theory that we are aliens that have been sent out from another planet and when we got here like we crashed and we it's been so long that we just have forgotten our old society and we established ourselves on earth so it just grew because like dude the pyramids man like how they do that you that's know? no that is insane. <laughs> there, there are pyramids no, on like the opposite side of the there, earth. Like, there is no way that like people back then could have done that without yeah. insane technology. Yeah, they didn't have me. How are they going to lift all those rocks? Uh, you, <laughs> dude, dude, no, honestly, dog. like, you think they could do that today? <laughs> like, no, no, we couldn't. That's the thing. They say we can't. Like, how would we? Would like, we unless crane? they were like, literally, humans back then were twelve feet tall. No, like, no, they no were I saw something. No, I saw something actually that it said uh, that human remains were found one time that the person was 15 feet tall. There's no way. I swear. Yeah. I didn't see pictures of that one tall guy. I don't know if he was 15 feet though. No, like, no, 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 no. 15 like, feet. No, like the dude had like a huge stature, like 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 a giant stature. Yeah. Dude, 15 feet couldn't fit in this building. I know. No. Like but not they even probably close. didn't even have buildings. They had those castles, my G. Uh, the castles, yeah. I want to visit a castle, like a medieval castle. That'd be so That cool. ain't a thing really anymore. I know. I- I'm sure I have like one, like Transylvania, you know what I'm talking about. Is that a real thing, actually? Like, that's a place. Like, yeah, wait, that's a place. It, it is yeah, real? Okay, okay, okay. I don't okay. know if they got vampires. But well, they, well I mean, real. obviously not that. Well, we don't know that, but. <laughs> yeah, we really don't. Gotta have an open mind nowadays. You know, yeah, you know, you it's do. 2019. You know. You know? <laughs> there are vampires, attack helicopters, they're Facts. everywhere. But yeah, I saw that movie. I'm like, is Transylvania actually like a real place? Where is it? I don't know. Somewhere over 
there. Like Over, in Europe? Yeah, like on the yeah, okay. Yeah, I think so. That's the closest you can get right there, just on okay, that wait, side. I'll look it up. Transylvania. I'm just curious. It's in central Romania. Central Romania. Bound on the east and south by its natural borders, the Carpathian mountain range, historical Transylvania, extend to westward to the Abusan Mountains. Hmm. So, I'm going to like look at it like a world map. Okay. It's like south... East of Poland. Mm. In mm. Romania. Yeah. Mm. So, yeah, it's more real than I thought. Yeah. <laughs> I knew it was a place. I just Underground castles over there? Yeah, that'd be sick. Dude, I watched uh, Hunting Hitler. That's a great show on uh, the History Channel. It shows like History his like, underground. Sick. Shout out History Channel. Yeah, it is sick. It's so sick. We'll do that. You want to stop? You want to stop? <laughs> it shows that? like <laughs> these underground tunnels that he made to like escape everywhere. Like, Who? Bartman oh, oh, was Hitler, so Hitler, smart. Hitler. Oh. Hitler. Talking about Hitler? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Not Bart. <Barbie. laughs> if James Why'd you say Bart, man. <laughs> yeah, I thought you said Bart, but I, I was did, like, I wait, did. what? No, oh, you did say Bart, but no, you freaking of the scumbag. Scumbag. Thing. <laughs> So Hitler had like, these underground tunnels, and they think Hitler got away to Argentina. No. You got to watch the whole show to understand it. But, like, dude, there's proof it probably happened. I'm a firm believer. So what, then? Like, did he just... He's dead now. Yeah, no yeah he's what. dead yeah, now. It but doesn't like, matter. But. So they were going to like try to like make the f- the Fourth Reich, and they had oh, like yeah. concentration camps in Argentina that like no one knows about. Where? In Argentina, South America. Swear? I, I didn't know that. Well, I thought you said where, <laughs> but yeah. Nice. They it's do. Sweet. You got to look it up, man. What? It's insane. That's actually wild. Yeah. So why like don't a, we learn about that? We don't. Yeah, because like. It's useless. Well, they're just uncovering. Well, it's a lot not of it necessarily now. useless. That it's could, not, yeah, it's not useless. There could be you don't evidence there, yeah. like you know, like just there could have it could have changed the possible outcome of yeah World War Two. There's this one show where it's like, what if Hitler won World War Two? Oh my god! Like the most, the majority, the, the United States goes to Germany, and then like all the like the president will speak like German, but the common folk still speak English. Right, and then the West Coast went to Japan. Because they were with him. It's a crazy wow. show. Wow. It's wild. Thorncott. I think we have a little story. <laughs> Doran Pot, if you will. <laughs> you want to... <laughs> nah, I'm cool. You don't want to tell it? Nah. You can't. It's, it's, it's one of those things. Most people know about it. If you want to know <laughs> about it, hit us up off the podcast um it's definitely uh sensitive yeah <laughs> material okay. i guess not really all right <laughs> hit us with your secret skill what's that a secret skill i uh, i'm great i'm great on a grill um that's like unbelievably one. fantastic on a grill yeah that's good i like that one Never mind. Go ahead, cop. I'll wait. I don't even know. You're good at dancing. That is fair, <laughs> but... Yeah. Why'd you get up so close when you said that? Because we have to. Yeah, when you get close, it's like, ooh. Yeah. When you sit far, it's like, ooh. I, it, it, ooh. Just feels, it just feels better. It feels more appropriate. I feel yeah. like I'm on an actual podcast. You can hear more oof. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. There's a little oomph <laughs> behind it. Mm. But secret skill, yeah, I can cook. Um... Hashtag women. <laughs> I wish I could work on cars. That'd yeah, be that'd that's, be that's sick. A good skill. That'd be sick. People used to do that. Not, it's like a dying profession. Dying, it is a dying thing. I mean, but well, some mechanics can make a lot of money. Yeah, well, a lot yeah, of that's, money. That's Ignorance like, amount of money. Yeah, yeah, I'm saying like no, not profession. That was a bad word. It's like you know, like people used to like fix up cars right, all the right, time. Yeah. Like, it's a hobby. Like our dads tell us about it all the freaking time. Like, yeah. oh yeah, man, me and my buddies. <sighs> That Trans Am. <laughs> Just get, get under the hood there. You know, we got the Kaufman Car Club. I'm in that. Are you really? Yep. Shout out Kaufman Car Club 2019. Join it if you haven't already. It's pretty fun. Go to a lot of car shows. See a lot of cool cars. Maybe sweet. sometimes even get to sit in them. So. That's sweet. I do uh, the valet with all the people that do the valet. Oh, yeah. So, like, I drive yeah, a yeah. bunch of cars. That's sick, actually. That is, yeah. is a cool job. It's just, I don't know how I feel about it, though. 
migrating to a different location every time you have yeah, to work it's like, like there's been a lot of controversy about it and like i try to stay in one spot and now i am in one spot so that's nice it's not where are you that bad you? uh you know oscars across the river uh like in new in old dublin yeah 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 i'll be there yeah. most days isn't that where beta works yeah well no he goes like <coughs> yeah you're there bright high like mezzo yeah, 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 yeah. Mostly in Dublin. Like, the Dublin kids like to stay in Dublin, but they put, like, Hilliard kids in Dublin. It's a big controversy. Hilliard kids in Dublin? For what yeah. reason? Be- Why is that know, a controversy? Dude. Who knows? Because, well, the controversy is it's the same distance from Hilliard to downtown and Hilliard to Dublin. So why would the really? Hilliard kids not go to downtown instead of to Dublin? <laughs> yeah, because it's, like, two Hilliard exits south away, of Dublin, three yeah. exits away. Wow. And downtown is... We were we wonderful. were just talking about that the other day in the baseball dugout. If you if you told me where a city was, like on an Ohio map, yeah. I probably could tell you like maybe four. Well the thing about it is like you just gotta know <laughs> like Marysville, the highway goes like northwest. And then like the rest of the Well, I know two seventy is just a big two seventy is just a big circle. So if you want to go Columbus. east and you go west or no no east. If you want to go to Columbus you go south, Hilliard South, UA south, right? Yeah, yeah. U.A. is towards yeah. Columbus. It's not that bad. I mean, hey, I got the map, man. The, the map, man. The Google Maps. <laughs> Apple Maps. I use Apple yeah. Maps. Or Waze, dude. Have you guys used that? Yeah, Waze is nice. Tells you where the cops yeah. are. I introduced that to my dad. He needed to know yeah. that. He needed to know what Waze was. Yeah. It's, it's, Does the cop thing actually work on that app, though? Yeah. I think so, yeah. Like, it's pretty I, accurate. Whenever I see a cop, I click it. I don't, I've yeah. never used it, but... Well, see, people were thinking, like, what if the cops just put cops everywhere so people all drive slow? Well, that would just no, be... No, I don't think you can do that, bro. Uh, well, I mean... Because you, you can drive past and say, no, there wasn't a cop there. Uh, that's true. That's true. You're so smart. <laughs> but... There you go. That's much better. I like this. Sitting CJ, up straight. What's your guilty pleasure? I mean... I have no idea. Like... I mean, it depends. Like, I yeah. I mean, I don't have and I don't have any shame in this. Like, I've told this to my buddies before. Like, there's no shame in this. Like, uh, I consider myself a pretty kinky guy. I mean, like, me and my spouse. You know, we <laughs> we have we, we're very experimental, and it makes our I mean, we're 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 all eighteen years old here. Okay, we're we're grown ass adults. Okay, so we can handle our we can handle ourselves. So you know, our sex life is it's fairly interesting, and it's just it's better than just uh, what normal people do. I meant like goldfish or something. (laughs) Yeah, he meant like I eat ice cream. (laughs) Yeah, 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 yeah. But I love it, dude. I love it. No, hey, I respect. I can't. Wow, <laughs> that's so <laughs> fucked. Like something like no, that's that. A good like, one, that's bro. a good one. That's funny shit. A little bit of spanking every now and then. Yeah, not bad. It's not bad. That's whatever. That's what comes to mind when you that's say guilty funny pleasure. Shit, though. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> no, I respect that heavy, dude. I feel. I re- I relate. <laughs> Facts. Lauren Cott, what's your guilty pleasure? I don't know. I mean. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 No, no. Chocolate chip ice cream. Uh, Black raspberry chip. No. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty good. But I like bubblegum cotton candy. Some, uh, that's the best. That's unbelievably fucked. What I'll grab happened? I'll grab some Timbits <laughs> and a large ice cap Supreme. I'll be set. Nice. That's yeah. from Timmy, Ho- Timmy Hose. Yeah. That's sweet. I'm going to have to grab some after this, actually. That you sounds guys, so good. You guys think, all right, I'm going to ask questions, and you just say one or the other. Bet. Starbucks or Tim Hortons? Tim Hortons. Uh, Tim Hortons. I don't really go to Starbucks. Interesting. Starbucks Chick-fil-A is overpriced. or Raisin like Cane's? Cane's? What was it? Chick-fil-A Cane's, or Raisin Cane's? Cane's has better sauce. Chick-fil-A has better chicken and fries. Fact. But if you can Pulled the words right out of my mouth. Cane's has bread. So you go to Cane's? Yeah, Cane's is so good. I go Chick Fil A every time. I have been going Chick Fil A every time, at least once or twice a week. Chick Fil A is so good. I have not hit that in so long. It's uh, Tuesday. I thought it was the weekend. I thought it might be Sunday. I'm like, nope, Tuesday. Let's go. <laughs> Dude, Tuesday has buy one get one free boneless wings at B Dubs. Oh, oh shit, that's tonight. Such a great, such a great thing. It is a good thing. I paid for Mo's wings last week. 
Damn, he got you. Wings are expensive at beat ups. Well, I mean, it was the bottom. They're like yeah. fourteen. Money ain't an object to me. Yeah, so. dang. that's crazy, <laughs> dude. I think the best place to eat around here has to be Yogi's. I've seen that place so many times. It's so good. Go in and get the chicken fingers, dude. Oh. Yogi's oh, Barn so Grill. Yeah. Chicken fingers. It's Where is it again? Tea. It's uh on like France Road, and there's one on Hard Road up in by Salmo. Yo, Swenson's or McDonald's. Oh, we were about to go Swenson's last night. Swenson's or McDonald's. Swenson's easily. I mean, uh, it's Swenson's a, is really good. It's just pricey. It's more pricey than McDonald's, That's big facts. but it's because it's better food. It's experience. Cheap as hell. No, it is expensive. Like, ex- dude, I get the, I get the big cup of uh, root beer milkshake. Oh, that's my guilty pleasure, dude. <laughs> but and that's just like eight dollars. <laughs> I'm a savage, so I don't care. <laughs> eight dollars. If you can, if you can hear my facial expression, <laughs> <laughs> hear my facial it would expression. Sound like Billy, you're a dumbass. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, Swenson's is definitely better than McDonald's, and I don't blame them for the price. It's so much better food. I mean, you go to McDonald's, you don't expect a. Yeah. Like, it, why'd you go to McDonald's? Like, well, the first time because you need something to eat. <laughs> like, I haven't eaten McDonald's in like six years, seven years. Like, I just don't eat anything from there. I get the tea, the sweet tea, and that's yeah. it. I don't get the food. Best sweet tea. Um, but like the first time I had a Swenson's burger, I'm like, dang, this kind of tastes like McDonald's. So I thought, it might be you know, it might be related somehow. Maybe they're using some of the same stuff. It's crazy. Yeah. Have you guys been to uh, Top Golf? Yeah, no. it's fun. It is. I want to go I'm though. Like, I'm like a terrible golfer, but like I need. I'm not too it. bad. Hit me up if anyone wants to go, because yeah, like I'm down. It's decently expensive. It is. Well, it's like 25 for an hour. 35. Yeah, don't you have to have no, like eight people so to it's go? It's 45 for a bay of six. So, what is that? Here, I'll do it real quick. I'm retarded. I can't do it. It's 7.50 an hour if you go with six people. <laughs> And then, like, the food ain't that bad. Like, when I went, I went for an hour and a half. I paid, like, maybe, like, 20 some dollars. And I got the $5 membership card. And you have that for life. So, like, wow. next time, probably be, like, 20 bucks. Damn. Not that bad. I think. <laughs> I don't know. It, it's a fun pastime. So. Oh, I had another. Oh, no, no, no. Actually, before. This has been on my mind. We were coming back from. We were coming back from Taco Bell the other night, and he said something about a red light, and it blew my mind. Oh, yeah. What is it? So, we were just sitting at this red light, and uh, it turns green, and, like, I just, everybody goes, and I just have this, like, feeling, I'm like, wow, that light really just told everybody what to do. (laughs) Like, it's insane that, like, we actually obey a light. Yeah. And, like, if we don't obey a light, we're then, afraid of then, the repercussions. Then somebody yeah. will come after us and find us. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's like, that's like that's the rules insane. of society, though. Society is like. We just follow a light, though. Society is the sheep herder, and we're just the sheep. Yeah, that's facts. You know, like, in, like, I don't know, this might sound like stereotypical, but, like, in Afghanistan, like, they don't have road laws, so you can do whatever. Yeah, like. India, like, people just ride motorcycles. Like, there's, like, a million motorcycles and then, like, cars. They're swerving the lane. Like, there's nothing. But see, the thing about it is, though, like, that's why we're so prosperous. Like, the United States of America, like, we have laws because that keeps us in order. But sometimes there are some laws that are, like, overstepping. Oh, yeah. I think Obviously. I'm, like, a well, strong advocate of, like, self-defense laws. Yeah. Like, dude, someone come If anyone... If someone is on foot set foot on your property you have the right to do whatever you want to that person that's a fact yeah but it ain't like that all the time yeah that's true that's scary you know recently I mean, what if that was a rule what if that was a rule well, i'd probably be shot and killed by now some places it is like and it depends what you're doing too like if like someone's like trying to attack you obviously you can What's that noise? oh that's my foot that's crazy <laughs> but I think, uh, oh shoot, what was I going to say? Are you talking about the, the, in some places? In some places, we well, could do that. I don't know. That was the end of my thought. There was something there. If Lost a train. Back. Lost a yeah, train. Dang. Damn. That is the How worst. How about that G feeling. Fuel, though? G Shout Fuel. Out that G Fuel. Right there. Yeah. What's your favorite G Fuel flavor? Phase Bear. 
I think the Raspberry Blue is good. Or, wait, what's the blue? Oh, Ice. Blue Ice. Blue Ice is yeah. decent. Blue Ice is classic. <laughs> you know they're coming out with cans. Really? Yeah, this summer. Oh, that's crazy. In stores, yeah. Quick 24 pack. That'd be wild. I think uh, the C4, the Raspberry C4, or what is it, Blueberry Raspberry? One of them. Mm. It's like the light blue one. That tastes so good. I don't blue drink raspberry? C4. Yeah, something like that. Blue Raspberry. C4 good. gives me like the itches. Yeah, it gets you like shaking. Yeah. 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 <laughs> It gets me right in the gym, though. Yeah, That's yes, a fact. lifting. Yes, still rec man. Nope. I know you're a rec man. Are you? I mean, be? like I am, but you're the rec man. I mean, I'm a registered rec man for sure. Uh, but the problem with that is baseball season. Oh, uh, that's tough. God. Oh, you guys have like five baseball games season a gets week. In, that's ridiculous. It gets in the way we of literally everything. Wow. Every single thing you want to do, baseball is in the way. Senior tag sucked ass because we had to worry about baseball. We couldn't fucking do anything. Fucking work schedules. We kept we got, we're at baseball twenty four seven. Like, yeah. I mean, yes, I did sign up for the sport because are most I love of them the sport, uh, are most of them pretty explicit. Or is this one just extra explicit? No, uh, there's some that are explicit. Like, okay, <laughs> if if you want an explicit one for people listening, you go to Kyle Allring's episode <laughs> because there were some stories. I just saw a squirrel fall out good. of a tree. I'm so no weak. Way. No, like it was like a hundred feet. I'm not <laughs> kidding. I'm not kidding. <laughs> It was so far. Like, this, like, skinny tree right here, it was, like, at the top. I saw it fall all the way to the ground. No oh, This tree right behind me, you see My this big, God. like, crack in the window? That's from, like, one of the branches. Like, they were just here, like, early in the morning, oh, and shit, they heard yeah, a big crash. So, like, Adam comes in here, and he's like, holy shit. That tree, like, you can see it down there. It's, like, a bunch of logs, like, fell, and, like, I think it hit the wood. So, like, that's why the window didn't shower, shatter, because if a log went through the the, the actual glass, it probably would have broke it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Which, thank God, it didn't, because, you know, that would suck. But they're going to that replace soon. It's, like, you know, it's not their responsibility. It's, like, the people that own the place. Are it's probably extremely expensive. Oh, yeah. Online. Do you live here? No. Okay. I didn't At the that. office? I didn't know if this was, like, you know. No, like, this is the stew, dog. The stew. Come on, man. We're in the stew. What do you think this is? It's the stew. Yeah. It's just dope. It's uh yeah, vibes. I like I like the stew, it's fun. So I what's your my own stew? What's your favorite unpopular opinion? My favorite unpopular opinion? Or, yeah. Unpopular opinions are stupid. Dang. Wow. Stuff. You even said earlier. That's what I was saving. Unpopular opinions are stupid. Wow. Get them is, off my Twitter feed. That's so stupid that you saved that. I usually agree with the unpopular opinion. Usually. Uh, I mean, most of the times I agree with them. Like, usually they're hilarious. I don't know. Unpopular opinion. I don't know why. Well, I just get a bunch of stupid ones. Like, do you think morning showers are better than night showers? I think morning showers are superior. Nah, just because yeah. like you fall asleep in a morning shower. Okay, no. I no, I shower I in the morning. In the morning I shower in the morning usually. Yeah, I wake up every in day the before school. I shower, but. And you want to go back to bed? I mean, yeah, I get it. It's warm water. Like when I'm, yeah, you get a problem. Yeah, a little bit. that's a little sus. You got sleep, sleep deprivation or whatever it's fucking freaking called. Yeah, you need some C4. You need some G fuel in your life. Yeah. I think uh nice shower in the morning, wake you up, get dressed, you're all clean. And then at night, like... Depends on what I did the day before. Yeah. I mean, like the day of, not before. I can agree with that. Like, if you go, like, if you like baseball practice, obviously. Yeah, obviously I'm out, showering. Like, if I... Went to work. Yes, I'm obviously I'm showering. Oh, after work? Yes, dude. Every time. Yeah. That's a good one. That's a good that one. That's good. I do some, like, catering stuff, too. And, like, after that, like, you just, you smell like food. Well, you know, now I think about it, the past couple of weeks I've showered every night just because I've had something yeah, every night. I like baseball, yeah. Yeah. Like, if it's not baseball, it's something else. I respect that. You guys take baths? Yeah. yeah. I do. A bubble baths? No. Oh. I just take... Sometimes ice baths, like just by myself. Really, ice baths? I can never do that. I will get too cold. Like just, just real quick, a quick yeah. five minute ice bath, and it would, it, it, it gets you right. I'll yeah, tell you that much. Yeah. It gets you right. But then when I'm sick, like whenever I get like the flu or strep throat or something like that, I'll like sit in like a hot bathtub and put some Epsom salts in there, and it relaxes me. That's sweet. Multiple times I've fallen asleep in the bathtub. Really? If That's someone walked dangerous. in, they would have thought I was dead because yeah. I was out cold. Like, I was just like, <sighs> like, couldn't wake me up. Yeah. Felt right. so good. We'll have one last 
topic of discussion. What up? So summer after high school, some people are going to try to, you know, travel the world. Some people are going to, you know, just chill, enjoy time with friends. What are you guys planning on doing? Uh, I'm not a hundred percent sure yet, but I'm thinking playing baseball. I'm probably going to play like Juco baseball in like Florida or something. That's sweet. I don't know. Probably mix of both. Oh, I yeah. guess I want to go somewhere. I'm going on vacation in summer. I'm going to Aruba. Aruba, uh, Jamaica. Mm-hmm. Ooh, I want to take, take it. <laughs> That's good stuff. Have you been to Aruba? Yeah, I went last year with my family. That's sick. Is it fun? What do you recommend? Uh, I mean, the water is just... I mean, I'm sure there's plenty of people that can vouch for me, but the water there is literally crystal clear. It's yeah. insane. Like you can stand in four feet of water and see your feet. It's unreal. So That's sweet. Sand is nice there, too. It's, like, very, very fine sand. Yeah, fine sand. That's yeah. how we like it. Yeah, very yeah, All the sand is, like, fake. Yeah, it's yeah. all just... Interesting. It's actually man. man-made beaches. Yeah. Half the beaches, really? like, on the East Coast. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's oh. ridiculous. But, um... It'd be, it'd be cool to go to Aruba. I want to go to uh, Punta, Punta Cana and uh, Cancun. Those Cancun. are, like... I always hear good things about those places. What's in Cancun? Like, it's, like, the resorts and stuff. Nothing spectacular. I don't know. I mean, like, everywhere you go, like, those places, I think, like, if you leave, like, the general population, like, it's dangerous. Yeah. Like, in Cancun, for yeah, example. Yeah, it's like, pretty dangerous. Like, a resort. I think so. <laughs> Pablo. Yeah. It's wild. Pablo. All right. Talk about real sand. <laughs> Do you guys have any closing remarks? Thanks for having us. My apologies for being explicit. Dude, that was so good. No, I that like was hilarious. I mean, no one told me. <laughs> I, I, mean, know, you, I was trying to you bait you, honestly. Yeah, you, I was you, like, you, yeah. It was kind of a bait question, <laughs> but like I, I was like, wow, there's, it's kind of strange. I knew what you are talking about, but I was like, it's a weird way of saying it. Yeah, yeah. I had no clue what you were talking about. That's the first thing that came to my mind. Yeah, no, I, like, I guess I guess I that tells too, people where like, my mind goes yeah, you know, most oh, of yeah. the time. Oh, we're all sick fucks. Facts. <laughs> I'm a savage, you know. So yeah. it happens. Like so, I'll just eat. I'll just eat goldfish for hours, dog. Goldfish, goldfish are, are so good. Oh, I'll that's... get one of those huge <laughs> cartons. Dude, the, you, I got one at home ah. right now, man. They're so nice. dry. Every time I eat them, I, I, once again, I feel like I'm eating sand. Really? <laughs> I put I put the goldfish on my tongue and like smash the the big part. You know what I'm talking about? Like the head? Yeah. The head of the fish? Oh, yeah. If I can smash that. Thing. Like a Pringle, you know? Like a Pringle. Pringles Pringle, are nice. Put it on your tongue. Bye. I want to do that mixing Pringle challenge. I've like, never heard of that. Like, you just, like, you each give it with friends, and you mix Pringles, and you have to, that, like, tell them what flavor it is. Oh, yeah. That'd be fun. And you just, like, you know, close your eyes or whatever. Yeah. That'd be fun. That'd be way too easy. Nah, I don't think I it think would, dude. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes I can't tell the difference between barbecue and original. Like, with the Lay's bags at... Kaufman, that's a whole nother topic right there. Chips. Put some freaking chips in the bag. There's so much air. It's it, you get like, oh, here, enjoy your aspirin. Yeah. Like, <laughs> like, it's like those mini muffins. The those. Oh, those are I know. Rip rip like the little little Four. Debbies. Yeah. You buy a box that's twenty four by eight, <laughs> and there's like three bags in there. <laughs> there's that's three. Wild. There's literally twelve muffins in the yeah. whole box. Dude, there's. You expect these, them like, to be like this big with the <laughs> bags. It's so yeah. big, yeah. They're the goldfish kind. They come with nine packs of goldfish. You maybe get like 12 goldfish in there. He has one in this room right now in his office. Cool. It's like. Clown. I just. We're getting scammed, okay? Yeah. People are out to get you. You gotta watch your back. That's a fact. You can't trust any. Well. Everything's a yeah. business. Everything is a business. That's right. And everything should be run like a business. Your relationship like a business. If she ain't if she ain't putting in the cleaning and the cooking. Then why you <laughs> that's so <laughs> fucked. <laughs> it's that's, so that's a whole another that's a whole another avenue right there. Whole another country. Uh, All right, boys. Funny, but I'll put your Instagrams down below in the uh, YouTube video. But we're on iTunes, social media, or iTunes, <laughs> Spotify, Google Play, YouTube. <laughs> And we're all we're on like most social media, so like right. you guys gotta check us out. Yeah, I'll everybody's, check it out. Check everybody's us out. checking it out. Yeah. All right, thanks for coming on, boys, and uh, peace. We'll, we'll see you next yeah, week. Thanks for having us.